Hey there, Icarus here. I'm playing through every class in a Doom mod by the name of Bring Your Own Class. As you can see from the list here, there's quite a lot. In any case, enjoy a compilation of this week's entries. Kicking off with Pepino. Pizza time. Some of you may recognize this as the protagonist of Pizza Tower. Anyways, the move set that you've got access to here is interesting to say the least. Melee will see you thwacking enemies with a wide variety of just whatever the heck seems to be to hand, including yourself, somewhat paradoxically. There's also a charge dash alt that allows you to careen into enemies to deal damage. You can throw pizza at them, either in the form of an entire pizza or just individual slice. Honestly, the most normal things on the menu here appear to be a gun and a shot gun. There's dynamite, and if you need a special delivery done too sweet, you can always just run them over with a moped. Failing that, there's always the power of lightning or throwing the actual final boss of Pizza Tower at everyone. I don't know, I'm, I'm honestly genuinely confused by trying to understand anything in Pizza Tower. It, it is like being on acid. Oh boy, if you thought it was a trip plane as Pepino from Pizza Tower in BYOC, wait till you get a load of the noise. Why is he called the noise? I don't know. That said, the initial melee loadout here is kind of similar to that of Pepino. Maybe a little bit more goofy. I'll fire let you bounce around on a pogo stick. I think the pistol shot lets you shoot candy corns off a slingshot. And then there's also this big huge pistol, which... Yep, it does the job. Chicken drumsticks are apparently lethal. Even more so when you use the ult, because apparently they're spicy. I, I actually don't know what's happening here. Is he bouncing around on a space hopper? What is he holding? Whatever the heck it is, it uses meter. This was a thing with Pepino as well. I'm not entirely sure how it's applied. Not that that's going to help you understand chain gun that shoots sausages in any way. A box of... A, Mini maze and, and bombs and what 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 is happening? What is actually happening? Can, can any of you smell toast? I'm pretty sure I can smell toast. BYOC Pizza Tower Power Hour continues to pootle along. We've now got a, a stupid rat. That's actually that's literally the name. Took me a good long while to actually figure out what the gimmick of this one was, and I was slightly distracted by the small animated rat that mimics whatever your actions are on the bottom right side of the HUD. But the long and short of it is, if you pick up certain ammo types, that translates into a pool of different attacks that you can make the rat belch. That's not all though, the donut will allow you to do a Sonic-esque spin dash attack. The jelly will allow you to engage in damaging, bouncing movement that flings all sorts of crap up into the air. Pizza slices let you recoup health. Whatever the heck this is lets you summon green rats in aeroplanes. You got exploding rat balloons. Block of cheese does a hefty slam attack. The hotline lets you call for an extra delivery of pizza that gives you over health. And the bomb is just a big old bomb. It's a bomb. It goes boom. We continue to tumble down the BYOC rabbit hole with Pizza Tower Guy, a character that originally didn't start off in Pizza Tower, but actually started off here. It, it's confusing, but all you need to know is he's an alcoholic. The longer he is allowed to drink, the more powerful he becomes. His standard level 1 attacks involve being able to throw a bottle at enemies, and the old fire is a blackout drunk ability that just has you fall over and recoup health. Level 2? That gives you a more of a spread fire bottle throw in the primary, but the secondary, that just lets you throw up all kinds of stuff, including th these little guys. Level 3 will just let you punch everything to death, while the alt will just randomly teleport you back to the start of the level sometimes. Level 4 lets you do an energy blast, and the secondary is an even more forceful puke. And level 5 is an invincible giant stompy version of yourself. Alt does a mega heal. Oh, and you can also spend meter on fart. Oh god, we're still doing Pizza Tower adjacent stuff, aren't we? BYOC continues with the doys. Do you like the idea of a character where roughly 90% of everything you do will either hinder you or get you killed? Well, good news, you'll enjoy the doys. Whiffing on the melee here will occasionally have you just land flat on your back. The pistol, while comically huge, is nowhere near as comically huge as the unwieldy revolver, which straight up obscures the entire screen every time you fire a shot. As you might imagine, bombs are a little damaging considering you run headfirst into enemies with them before they explode. And on the similar front, the chain gun deals self-damage with the first shot of every volley, and because they're explosive based, that means splash damage. The bouncing rock is just a friggin' menace, the sniper rifle will knock you the F out every time you fire a shot, and for the love of god, do not activate Pedito and the Doys. 
You will, you will regret it. You cannot escape. He will find you, no matter how far you run. Anyways, that's it for this week's compilation of Bring Your Own Class. Hope you've enjoyed, and feel free to let me know what you thought in the comments. Also, big thanks to my patrons, currently scrolling up screen, and if you too would like to be part of this esteemed list, you can find a link to my Patreon page in the description below. This has been Mr. Icarus. Thank you very much for watching. Icarus out.